right, so this is going to be cleaning and pressing books for the Izzyverse NYC Part 6. And this is the last book that I am working on for him. And this is Strange Tales 178. Pretty nice book. I mean, it is discolored. It is got tons and tons and tons of soiling on the back. Um, and, you know, as it sits off white pages, that little tiny rip there. It, the paper is there, so I'll get that back in place, but it, the rip is still there. Um, you know, it's a cool book, but as it sits, it's probably like a 4.0. Um, reason being, discoloration. I'll get this cleaner, but I don't know if I'm gonna get this like screaming clean. And then, uh, you know, some color rub off. This is a partial color breaking fold. Uh, similar to my Secret Wars 8 that I cracked out and pressed and got signed and sent back in. It came back a 4.5. I'm guessing this book is somewhere in that range looks nice it'll probably look really nice slabbed but it's not going to grade really high but we'll see what we could do work on it a little bit restore it to some type of glory just want to look at it one more time spine tick wise i don't think there was much uh, there's a couple couple dimples let me get this light down here and this top edge of this cover which I could get out for the most part. I mean, that one's got a little color break to it. A little non-color break right there. This is a color break. Corner's got a little, little piece missing from it, it looks like, unless it's on the back side. Nope. Um, doesn't have a lot of ticks though, believe it or not. The spine is pretty nice. Other than that color rub off. Back cover needs a good scrub. So let's see what we can do. I'm going to start with that. All right. So that little fold rip, I'm not going to mess with until it's got hit with humidity. Because sometimes I've tried to push these back and they crack. And I don't want to risk that. So I'm going to wait until I hit it with moisture and then fold it back manually. Um, but I really should take it before and after. Because I think I can get a lot of this soiling off. Absorine sponge. I do have the clay of the Absorine. Here's the catch with that stuff. If the book has the slightest bit of water damage to it, it will not just take off the dirt, it will take the ink off completely. Trial and error, I know because I did it. Uh, and I don't want to risk it on an old book that could have been exposed to moisture at some point in its life. Uh, so I'm going to go through this. I'm going to click the speed up button. So I'm not going to talk through this because I got a lot of scrubbing to do. Uh, so I'll see you guys in a few minutes.
I just scrubbed this book pretty good and uh it's it's dirty man um so i want to say i'm busting out the big guns but uh I'm busting out some absorine because i think it uh it needs it so i'm just trying to roll this into a hot dog i haven't used it in a while This stuff just does not want to come off. We got these things here inside that star and over here tried using the eraser just not getting it out um, I got a lot of this cleaned up but even the words are blurred just from Whatever happened to this back cover? Because the back cover was uh, it's rough. You can even feel whatever's on there. I just can't get it off. I mean, me personally, if this was my book, I would probably double hop this back cover, try to get some of that off. But uh, I'd also be afraid it would lift some of this ink off that's already smeared. Um, so, you press it, clean it up a bit. At the end of the day, it still might only be a 4-0 book. So, uh, let me steam it and get it in the press. I did already clean the front cover. All right, I did the best I can cleaning this book, but you know, as you guys can see, it's pretty soiled. But I press it anyway. Um, I'm gonna recommend not not reading this book just because of the conditions. It's a little rough. all right you guys know the drill 10 minutes under heat and about three hours to cool off completely so i'll see you in a few minutes
where they mostly came out. One on the edge is gone. See that little rip is still there, but the fold's not. Cleaned it up best I could, but still does not look that great to me. A little waviness here too. I'm gonna throw this in the press one more time. But more of a story. Not every book can be saved, and this is uh, this is one of them. So um, the best I could, but just my opinion, I wouldn't send this book out. Hope you liked this video. Sorry it was disappointing. Hope you learned something. If you did, hit that like button. See you next time. I could do this all day. Mm -hmm.